He was a smart aleck. Very smart. Born in 1847 in Edinburgh, Scotland, young Alec developed a special way of communicating with his hearing-impaired mother. He would speak close to her forehead so she could feel the vibrations of his voice. He moved to Boston at age 24 and founded the School for Deaf Mutes. He was an innovative teacher. But for years, he dreamed of inventing a machine that would help the hearing-impaired listen and speak. His work on a new kind of telegraph led him to believe that voices could be reproduced over a distance. In 1876, at age 29, he received a patent for a device with a transmitter and a receiver. Three days later, preparing to test the device, he spilled acid on himself. He called out to Thomas Watson, his assistant in the next room, Watson, come here, I want you. Watson heard him through the receiver. The device worked. The inventor called it the telephone. When he died in 1922, every phone in the country observed a moment of silence, a poignant tribute for Alexander Graham Bell.